Let's open this box. I just got a box from scrapbook.com and I want to see what's inside. So I love how they package all of this stuff. Um, when they send us boxes and goodies, they've got such cute tissue paper. Let me see if I can get this out of here. I guess the first thing that stands out to me is their adhesive rollers. These are new. Um, they've got so many of these. Let's see what they are. <clears throat> Dotted adhesive roller. 49 feet each, um, double-sided. Those will be fun to try. I think I'm liking the, the size on those. Okay, this is permanent deluxe adhesive roller. 98 feet of adhesive. That's a good start. I don't know, you know, there's really never enough adhesive, but 98 feet's a pretty good start. Okay, this is permanent as well and refillable. I'm not sure about this one. It doesn't say refillable on that one, but this one says refillable. 49 feet, uh, permanent adhesive roller, refillable. That's pretty cool. Here is some more permanent. This is double-sided, translucent, 49 feet. Oh, uh, let's see. This says permanent, this says permanent. Translucent, acid-free, double-sided, 49 feet, refillable, permanent. Maybe, <laughs> I know, I know. This is making more sense now. This is the refills for this one. I couldn't figure out why they were different when they were both the same thing. They are the same thing. See, that looks like the side on this side. These are the refills for this one. Makes more sense now. Forgive me guys, I have a cold. And this also makes sense. These are the refills for this one. Look, it, it even says refill. I'm a genius. Okay, so dotted adhesive and permanent adhesive. Also deluxe adhesive roller, permanent. Okay, so those are scrapbook.com new um, <clears throat> adhesive. Okay. This, obviously, is the new Distress Ink. Yay, saltwater taffy, oxide, and um, what do you call it? Distress Ink, just the regular Distress Ink, and tons of taffy. I'm gonna have to try that. I'm sorry, guys, if I seem a little out of it today. My family's getting over a cold, so my brain's not working and my voice isn't either, but I was excited to open this up and share it with all of you, so. Also, <clears throat> wow, look at all of these new pops of color. These are just, I think, a ton of really summery colors. Um, and I've done videos in the past of pops of color. I really like these. I love working with these. Really fun. Let me show you a quick card I did. I used some pops of color on this one to make the little paint smears on this artist palette or painter's palette. Isn't that so cute? I had to look up what this was called because I knew it was a palette. Um, but there's also a palette, which is like, you know, the, isn't that the roof of your mouth palette? Uh, and they're spelled differently. I, I figured that one out too. So if I'm writing about a palette, like this kind of palette, don't use the spelling for your mouth because that just doesn't work. Um, maybe I'll edit out that rambling. I don't know. But pops of color on this card. Super cute. Also... This is from scrapbook.com. Is this vellum? It doesn't quite say. I believe 
see. Yes, this is vellum. I love vellum for all kinds of crafty goody things. I think it's a really great, um, great something to have in your craft. I love, I love it. I love vellum. You can die cut it. You can color on it. Lots of, lots of cool things. It adds a really fun um, element to your cards. And that's what's in this box. Um, lots of adhesive, lots of pops of color, and some vellum. I think I'm going to probably be doing some stuff with these. Um, doing some crafting with this new stuff. Um, and I'll be excited to show you guys what I make. If you have any ideas on what you want me to make with all of this, post them down below. Um, I'm always uh, looking for new ideas. But I want to try some of this taffy here. I haven't had taffy in a long time. I don't know if I even remember what it tastes like. I do remember that as a kid it was not my favorite, so let's see if that's changed. Oh. I don't think that's changed. I think it's an orange, orange flavor, but it mostly tastes like plastic. Guaranteed to pull out your fillings. Hmm. Okay. Once you get chewing it, softens up. It's not as bad. It's more like soft plastic now. I'll just delete it. It's sugar. 